here. So this um, workshop at this point has four guided meditations within it. This is a very important workshop. Um, so this will get more added as they come through. But at this point, um, there are currently four meditations here. And so um, the four meditations that I'm going to read. So the four meditations, um, the first one is journey to connect with your guides. So this is going to take you into a deeper connection, establish um, the frequency and places where you meet your guides and, and bring that guides energy through more fully for you to connect with. Whether you hear, see, feel, or know, it's going to help you to connect more fully into the guides' messages and, and getting comfortable receiving that information from your guides. Um, the second meditation is crystal connection and alignment journey. So in this um, in this meditation, you will need to have some crystal or gemstone that you've connected with. Most um, most anybody who's probably reading the details or listening to this video has collected a crystal or a gemstone that they connect with. Um, and so um, basically within this um, meditation, you are going to use that crystal and gemstone. You're going to allow it to take you on a journey. Um, a big component of where my work is moving into is into crystals and working with crystals, whether be in the body in the earth or um or in our mind's eye and so i'm um, aligning and harmonizing with the energy of the crystals um, crystals are here as conduits of energy to help us connect more fully and so it's going um, basically it's going to be helping you to raise your frequency connect more fully hear more clearly and that's actually the third um the third meditation within this series, the crystal journey part two. Um, once you've already established um, the journey with your first uh, crystal and made a connection and understood what the crystal's um, purpose and alignment for you in this um, time and space is, then you will, after you've worked with that crystal for a while, you will um, then perform the third um, meditation with which is the crystal journey part two and in this meditation you move um, into a, a sacred space that um, that basically um, surrounds you with the frequency of the specific crystal and so it amplifies basically um, amplifies your attunement into this crystal and um, and helps you to be very clear on the work that you're supposed to be doing and so um, like I said there's going to be um, I don't know if it's going to be my fourth or fifth book. We'll see what one needs to write itself first. But um, part of my timeline is um, I figured out my original timeline um, connects very fully into a time and space where crystals um, are a big part of our lives. And this is a future timeline, um, which is my original timeline. And I'm here. Um, one of my main purpose goals is to help to teach people about um, the power of crystals. And so um, I can foresee a lot more meditations coming into this specific um, this specific group here. So the fourth uh, meditation within this workshop is find your frequency. And so this is um, this is a huge meditation and you will probably perform this meditation over and over. And um, it's basically establishing your frequency at this moment in time and understanding what it means to be in that frequency and you'll be able to set um, set physical kind of reminders to allow you to feel into that frequency and um, and then basically you're going to establish raising your frequency and so over a series of these meditations you'll be able to raise your frequency and know what it feels like to move in and out of the different frequencies which is then the different dimensions so this will help your work and help you grow into being able to handle more work within this field um, and that is uh, the main the main components of the frequency your field workshop with light and love